All right, you know what? You know what? Let's take a moment here. Just, uh, okay, equip the compass. I do remember I didn't finish looking at the royal waterways yet, but these things, you gotta just pull out time for them. Otherwise, you'll never have time. Okay. Uh, the Black Egg Temple is really close. We can go back to the Grandpa. But otherwise, even in Dirtmouth, there's a few places. Yeah, if you look on the, um, the right side here, I didn't go to the very end. The mine shaft? The bench there, that's not to the very end either. Okay. Well, let's look at the Black Egg Temple. How about that? I don't think good things will happen there, but... You gotta do some of these things sometime, right? Hear a ringing. Do you hear it? Perfect. The original sad guys. These civilized bugs of Hallow Nest were weak in life, and now they are equally weak in death. Send them back into the dirt they were born in. That's rude. The fragments. Don't they ring? No, I'm definitely hearing a ringing. It's very faint, but it's there. Yeah. Okay, I don't need money right this moment, so maybe I'll skip out on Grandpa until we, we find something that needs a lot of money. Because otherwise, I'll just be carrying a whole bunch of cash on me for no reason, right? Okay. Yeah, the cocoon we found was definitely the one on the right here. The one with two eyes. Nothing? Not even an inspect? Were those things glowing white before? I don't remember. Okay, they, they just marked it on my map. I don't have to do anything here. That's... Suspicious? Eh, well... Like I said, let's just have a look around. Quite a few places we didn't get to the end of. And we're coming back with some new abilities too, so hopefully we'll find new places. At the very end of this one we found. But did I actually get to the very, very end? Because sometimes just going into the map gives you the completion for the map purposes. But I didn't actually finish looking around inside yet. Ah, yeah, this, um, this one had a worm. That's right. Okay. Once upon a time, this was probably some fancy banquet place. Ah, the mine shaft. My favorite bug girl. Hey! Hey, why are you not singing anymore? What have you found? <laughs> Bury my body, cover my shell. What meaning in darkness, yet here I remain. I'll wait here forever till light blooms again. <laughs> Bury body, cover shell. Darkness, no meaning. Dangerous. Still remain light again. She's sad now. Why? She was singing before. What happened? Oh no, is she getting infected? Were her eyes always orange? I don't quite remember. Thank you. Why 
is the elevator automatically going up? I didn't even tell you to go up. Okay. We don't have a map here, actually. Oh! Oh! Oh my god, it's another new place. <laughs> I come here to try to find the old places, and you give me a new place. <laughs> Wait, I saw rancid eggs there. But I can't get back over. Okay, fine, fine. Okay, we'll get the map and get out of here. I really need to clear out some old- Oh, Crystal versions. I want to clear out the place. Oh, this is also the same as... We haven't been here. Because it was too dark last time, right? Probably. I love how the kingdom has fallen apart, but all these toll gates still remain, and they all still work. Right, 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 we came in here, and I was like, whoa, never mind, bye, because it's so dark here. Now we know, it goes to the Crystal Peak. Okay, they don't particularly rush towards me. Fine. Okay, you know what? Maybe I'll put this one off too, because I'm here to look at the Forgotten Crossroads, <laughs> not to find a new place. Glimback. Slow, hardy creature. The crystals that grow on its back provide extra protection from foes above. Everyone's evolving certain properties according to the place they live in. But the one, the one thing everybody has in common is <laughs> Some sort of seasonal depression. Everyone just looks so sad. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I'm looking at the very bottom right. At the bench. It looks like we haven't reached the very end of that either. So I'm gonna... Yeah, just check it out. Check it out. Okay, this works. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you... You're annoying. Even after my nail got upgraded. Anybody with a shield is still sort of... hard. Damn! Oh, the tram. I don't think we got whatever they wanted me to get for the tram. That's right, that's right. Oh my- okay, I think we should go, we should go. Holy crap. <laughs> we gotta go. Right, here. What was this place? Oh, oh, we couldn't get to this house before because we couldn't climb the wall. This is where we rescued Sly. First time bench. Um. Should I go? Am I disturbing something? Oh, you surprised me! Hello, hello! Come in, sweetling! Come in and make yourself at home! Charm lover. I'm Salubra, and this is my cozy little charm store. Did the townsfolk out there tell you to come and visit me? No. Mmm, <laughs> yes. This is a lovely little village, isn't it? Warm and intimate and full of life. Mmm, what were we talking about? Oh, yes, charms. I can see you've started your own collection. Very nice. I'll show you some of my own, and you can take one home with you if you'd like. <laughs> For money, right? Lifeblood Heart. Have you ever drunk that bright blue liquid, lifeblood? It's a bit of a taboo. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't realize. But it makes you feel much healthier, doesn't it? This charm seeps lifeblood and will certainly improve your constitution. 
but the lifeblood goes away if you sit on a bench. So why would I want this over something like the fragile heart? Well, for one, it probably doesn't break. <laughs> That's probably why. Okay. How often does it come back, I wonder? Maybe you should buy this anyway, because... Oh! <gasps> Charm notches! Charm notches! Freaking go get it. Buy them all. Wait, hold on. Long nail. That nail you wield is adorable, but do you sometimes feel it could be a little longer? <laughs> That's what, never mind. Ho 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 ho! Go on, take this charm home with you. Suddenly, your enemies will be within reach. Steady body. I love the simple design on this little fellow, very classy. It's made of a nice, solid, heavy material, too. Wear it, and you'll be able to stay firmly in place when swinging your little nail around. Wait, when I swing my little nail around right now, do I not stay firmly in place? Hmm. Shaman Stone, are you a spellcaster, you little scoundrel? Ho ho, I'm only teasing. If you ever learn any spells, you should buy this charm for yourself. I've heard it will make a spell much stronger. A spell? Like Vengeful Spirit? That sort of thing? Quick focus. The crystal set in the center is lovely, isn't it? Exquisite even. I've heard that crystals help you to focus, so if that's something you're interested in, you should take this beauty home. Uh... Okay. Focus? Do I know what that means? Focusing? Charm Notch, you want to wear a lot of charms, don't you? Of course you do. Buy this and you'll be able to get more. And more. This one is a lot more expensive. This is a special item for those who love charms as much as I do. Once you own 18 charms, I'll gladly sell it to you. You only need 7 more, keep collecting. Oh, okay, so even if I'm rich enough, they won't give it to me. Fine, I'll take the first two easily. Damn, yeah, this is a whole new world. Yeah, at least we can have Thorns of Agony and the compass on at the same time now. <laughs> but I want to use my money anyway because... I'd rather have less money and more items. We haven't lost all our money so far, even once, thank goodness, knock on wood. But sooner or later, long nail. Like longer than what I have it right now? Eh, I'll buy it. Relying on charms though, lifeblood heart, steady body. Can't buy this. I need six more charms. Sure, just buy a whole bunch of them. Try it out whenever I can. Buy all of it. Shaman Stone. Making my spells stronger. Heck yeah, I'm poor now. But it's a nice kind of poor. <laughs> Thank you. Do you wear a lot of charms at once? It's a lot of fun, isn't it? Mixing and matching them to get the perfect combination? I don't know whether you've noticed, but some charms seem to like each other, yes. Mm. When charms like each other, they shine even brighter and sing even more sweetly. Really? Combinations. Hidden combinations. Even more reason to try all sorts of fun and surprising combinations of charms. Mm -mm. You'll show me whenever you have a new favorite, right? <laughs> Something like that. It's a bit of a sin to wear too many charms at once, isn't it? Sometimes less is more. Mm -mm. Yes, you shouldn't try to cram on more charms than you can handle. The effect could be positively overwhelming. <laughs> really? My dapper gadfly, would you care to know how charms are made? I don't often tell my customers, what with the truth being a little morbid. But you're a sharp one, so you may have guessed already. Oh no. Probably some ritualistic sacrifice of other bugs. <laughs> Few ways a charm appears, but mainly, it's from final wish. A dying bug's potent desire crystallized into these gorgeous, powerful trinkets. Now don't go getting too sad. There are exceptions, of course, and really, it's quite beautiful. Makes them all the more precious. Mmm. -hmm. Just think of all the little bug souls that went into creating your collection. It's like a crowd of strangers in your pouch or purse or uh, wherever it is you keep them. <laughs> My pants pocket. Ooh, that's... That's actually exceptionally morbid. <laughs> it's rare enough that someone enters my store, but even rarer to meet one so striking. Those impressive horns, that fierce weapon, the air of mystery, oh, it's enough to make me swoon. 
Well, I'll definitely be coming back to buy more charm notches. You should have a bench. Wow, no wonder they have a fancy bench here. Because, you know, you gotta have a bench to equip um, a charm. So we got two more slots, which is less than I thought we had. But we got a whole bunch of other charms. Okay, while we're walking around here... Wait. Can I only have three? Because I have three slots here. Let me see. So if I put Gathering Swarm here... Oh, okay, new ones appear. I see. All right, never mind. I thought we could only have three for some reason. Let's try new stuff. Quick focus is three. Increases speed of focusing soul. Ah, okay, now I get it. It's for... Activating my spell faster. Healing faster. Could be useful. Lifeblood. Let's try the lifeblood one then, because I'm not sure what this one's all about. We have two extra hearts, but do they go away if I sit down? They go away, but they come back. Okay. Interesting. Would be good for a boss. Sure, we'll, we'll walk around a little bit with it, but I feel like, yeah, overly relying on having a lot of souls is not a good thing. Or a lot of um, hearts. So this is where we rescued Sly. He's got a temporary home here. I see, I see. There's other homes here, but they're all closed off. This is where we saw the Gru's mother then. Okay. Well, as far as the Forgotten Crossroads are concerned, okay, right in the center of the map here, next to around where the red marker is, there is one offshoot I didn't go to yet. Let's go there. And then at the um, next to the bench underneath Ancestral Mound, on the left side, there's also a little offshoot I didn't go to. Yeah, so let, let's try to go to those places. Fill it all out if we can. I mean, right now we don't have this kind of thing, but I hope later on, maybe in late game or something, there's gonna be an easy way to see, okay, like in this room you missed this thing, or no, just, you don't even have to tell me what I missed specifically. Just tell me that I missed something in a certain room. Because even something like that, a very small indicator would be very good in me trying to figure out what I missed. That's annoying. <laughs> but we got it. Yeah. Oh! Actually, behind these little rot worm thingies, I feel like would be a pretty good spot to hide some secrets, right? I don't think there are any here, but for future reference... No, not here. Just keep going. There was a stone here. We got it already. Hey, there's some kind of a... blocked passage. Wait, have we been here? I feel like I've never... seen this spot before. Oops. That's fine. Yeah, we've definitely... It's the thing about how you walk through one pat one part of the map and you think that you've been through everywhere, but no, because the map is big, you just don't realize that things have been missed. What the heck is this winding maze? Ah! Perfect. That's a great reason for us to be going back to to find all these little fragments. Sweet. Yeah, and we couldn't have done this without the, um, the wall sticking. I'm hoping that by now we have most of the abilities for just traversing the world in general. Here. 
Oh. Hi. There's a bench. Ah, oh, is this a hot spring? I know we bought that marker for it ages ago, but we never saw a single hot spring after that. I can't tell by the marker though. Yeah, it's a hot spring. Oh, cool. Maybe you get healed when you're in the hot springs. Hi. Oh, God. <laughs> They're angry. Now I'm just splashing water at you. That's all. <laughs> oh, cool. Maybe the hot springs heal you or something. I'm not sure. We were at full health here, so a little bit hard to tell. <laughs> cool, cool. Oh, so there's that- Ah, wow, okay. There's actually multiple benches in this area. Oh, you're gone already! That was fast! Sweet. Wow, little things that I just... didn't happen across before. Okay, let's go to... the spot to the left of the Ancestral Mound. Is that fair? Ooh, I feel like I can go up there. I can't stick to the wall, though. So something to note for the future. Maybe put a marker right here. Mm. Red again? There's multiple places that we can't seem to reach yet, so I'm guessing later on we might get something like, um, like a double jumping ability. Thank you. Or can we access it through this side? Oh, okay. Okay, never mind then. <laughs> yeah, that's not really anything. Let's just go up. Even in the maps that we've seen. Oh, where the frick was that one worm? There's corner for stuff. The one worm? That I thought I couldn't reach before, but now that we know how to pogo, we can reach it. It's in Forgotten Crossroads somewhere. Oh no, my poor heart. Wait, wait. This is to Green Path, no. Forgot about those crazy spikes. Ah, right, 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 right. Yeah, that's why we never went here, because we couldn't before. We couldn't stick to the walls. I want to see the entry. What's that guy's name again? This guy. Gruzzer. They only seem dimly aware of their surroundings, making them easy prey to cut your fangs on. What is it that guides them on their paths? It almost seems like they search for ways to die. Maybe that's why they're not really higher beings. Because they don't think that hard. What a suspicious spot. Yeah, that spot is suspicious. You're teaching me how to look down now? Okay. Oh! What? Hmm. Everything around here revolves around death. Like this statue storing dead stuff, dead souls, and then the charms. Charms are the crystallization of the dead bug's dying wish. Here we go. All my troubles.
Something here? Oh god. Oh no. There's a gate. You can see the gate here. Oh no. Okay. Okay, hold on, hold on. Brooding Moloch. Shh. Wait, I gotta like... Oh god! I got so lucky there. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Oh, that was a. Uh, oh, my, my heart was thumping. If I touch that, will you kill me? Let's clear it all out just in case. Whoa, that one attack where like it just covers the entire ground. I got so lucky there because I was healing during spots when I shouldn't be healing, but it turned out okay. Brooding Moloch. Hey, but you're like the location. Like, these guys were in the ancient basin, but then you're. You're so far away. Ah, but you know down there, the Shadow Creepers kind of look like the little guys in the Forgotten Crossroads too, so there is some linkage between this place and the Ancient Basin. Brooding Moloch, ferocious but extremely social creature, becomes aggressive if not able to mingle with its own kind. Oh. I hear this beast crying out sometimes as I prowl the caverns, although I've never actually laid eyes on it. Who or what is it calling for? As far as I can tell, its voice is never answered. That's so sad. It got lost. It's looking for its friends, but it got lost. Oh. Wow, even in these hidden spots, there's just like random boss monsters. That's a boss, right? Yeah. Do you mind if I borrow your bench, dude? Hey, back in this, um... Let me see. Back over here. Is there more happening? He's crying. Wait, what? Okay, there was definitely more up there. I thought maybe we could talk to the False Knight, just like how we talked to the Dung Defender. I'm scared. I know it, you're gonna do the whole popping up thing. No? What? You're just gonna cry? Why are you- Who's crying? Oh, there's multiple of you! I kind of feel bad for you. Oh, they were holding a, a ceremony for the one that died. Oh, I kind of feel bad, but... Let's see, let's see. Do we get an entry for killing them? If not, I might leave you alone. False knight. And we don't get an entry. Oh, we do. Maggot, weakest members of the kingdom of Hollow Nest, 
generally looked down upon and forced to do men menial labor. Oh, I feel so bad. Consisting mainly of sweet fat, these helpless creatures make excellent provisions for long journeys, best roasted over open flame. If they try to bargain for their life, just ignore them. They have nothing to offer. Well, they look kind of cute. But maybe it's best that I put them all out of their miseries. Oh my god. Wow, even revisiting old boss arenas gives you random crap. <laughs> Interesting. I guess that's that. Yeah, all y'all here. No, don't. Don't. Okay, I'm wandering aimlessly now. I need to... Where was I trying to go? I went over there. I think we should go to where the red marker is. If I remember right, that's also a spot with rumbly ground. Yeah. Oh god. Haha! <laughs> I quit it. Whoa! Damn. You can't get me. <laughs> you can't get me. What are you gonna do about it? Whoa! What the hell? Wait, he opened up a path! What? Are you kidding me? <gasps> oh, but this is one of those spots that we don't know how to get to yet because... Somehow, later on, we're supposed to be able to get past a long line of spikes. Just like the one near the ancient basin. Okay. But the time is not now. The time to learn how to do that is not now. Alright. Let's go down there pronto. <laughs> yeah, I think... I think Forgotten Crossroads is pretty much filled out now. Which is good to see. What about the other places? Mm. Ah! When we do the red marker, we'll go down and talk to the leg eater. Which is the one next to the bench there, in the center of the map. And then, to the left side, there is a pathway as well. Yeah, lots of pathways here and there. Oh god. E yeah, yeah, it's, it's all filled out. We even found a new place in the... In the meantime, that crystal peak. Hopefully opening up this rumbly place is not gonna open up a new place entirely. I'm just looking for stuff like vessel fragments and... Mask fragments, that's pretty much it. Not looking for anything major. Goodbye. Right, 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 right. Yeah, 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 we go back around and then... Right here, there is a rumbly spot. I remember, I remember. Okay, well, <laughs> I just... Oh god, I just messed it up. I gotta find some soul. Soul. See, as upgraded as my new weapon is, some of the smaller creatures still take multiple hits. I expect them to take less, but that never really happens. Whoa. A fossilized gome wedged into the rock. A gome. Thickly armored, it bursts from the ground to seize prey in its fangs. These brutes seem to be impervious to most damage, so you can sharpen your weapons on their thick hide or just lash away at them for your own amusement. They barely seem to notice. Mm, because you can't kill these things, so the only way to learn about them is to find a fossil version. Wow. Thank you. I'm poor again. I feel good. Because now I don't have to worry about my money. <laughs> Sweet.
Well, that's one red marker off my map. I think I need to get a little bit more diligent about marking things though. Like all those trees that we saw before. This one can go. Yeah. Alright. Now we just go down. Leg eater. Yo. Did you lie to me? Nope. Oh, there's so much here. Oh. Hey. Hey. Uh, you broke it. I gave you that charm as a gift, and you broke it. Clumsy little fool. Nasty. Apologize. Ask me nicely, and I'll fix it for you. Give me Geo, and I'll fix it for you. No. It's broken now and its power is sleeping. Very sad. Give me Geo and I'll fix it. What? No. No. And I'm not buying any of those ones either. <laughs> Go away. You're not going to offer any explanation? No. That's it. You're lucky I can't hurt you. <laughs> okay. Um, we should try out some other hearts, too. Or, hearts? Some other charms, too. Knowing this is two hearts is nice, but I don't need it right now. And it makes me... The more hearts we have, the less careful I am. Let's just be frank. <laughs> Quick focus. Long nail, I'm a little bit wary of relying on too much. Because we already have the Mark of Pride and all this. Fury of the Fallen. When close to death, Barra's strength will increase. Steady, no recoil. Shaman stone. Okay, we have two notches. Soul catcher. Stalwart shell builds resilience. When recovering from damage, the bearer will remain invulnerable for longer. Makes it easier to escape from dangerous situations. In that case, I mean, I, I feel like I'd rather try Fury of the Fallen. Hopefully this never happens, though. Okay, so... If I equip this, it's basically saying when things get tough, don't run away. Keep attacking. And then this one. This one is saying when things get tough, run away. There is a merit to both of them. So I'm not sure which one is better specifically. So maybe I'll try this one. I don't think I've tried it before. When I heal, I have a hard shell. That lets you ignore enemy patterns a little bit. Because you can heal whenever you want, right? Right across from us. Oh. Yeah, I don't think we're getting through this. Okay, well... No, another spot to put off for now, then. In fungal wastes? Uh, okay, the, the spot to the top left of the Mantis Village word... I know that's one of the spots that we couldn't get to, and we still can't because it's a little bit too high. Kind of like the palace grounds back in the ancient basin. But what about the spot next to the word Queen Station? To the right side, that leads to the bottom. That spot might be okay. Yeah, I still want to look at Green Path too, because I'm pretty sure... I think it was a stone sanctuary, but there's places where it was too dark, and I just never finished exploring it. Uh, this one we can take off now. This is where we rescued Breda. And I guess I'm going to put a red one here for now. Yeah, if I put something here, it means that I know there's something, there's a reason why I haven't done that part yet. But see, this one, I'm not sure why I put it off. Oh, maybe it goes to Deep Nest. Well, we'll see. Let's go here. And how would I do that? Go down. Just keep going. Oh! There's so much dangerous stuff here. Oh, God! Okay, hold on. <laughs> if I'm here anyway, right? I also want to try out the healing before we actually use it in battle. Okay. Queen Station. I don't remember there being any places that we couldn't go to, though. Maybe I just forgot. Because there's so many places here.
Oh no. Oh no. Hi. Hi. Okay, I, wa I want to try this out. Ah! I wasn't hurt just now, but I don't think I got hurt from the um, head banging. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Hey, there's only one. Oh, sorry. Many apologies. It was not intentional of me to, you know, try to murder your entire family. Accidents happen. Cut me some slack, please. And thank you. Okay, that spot. Ow. Okay, I still got hurt, but the for the majority of that part, I didn't get hurt, right? Because I had the shield thingy on. Oh jeez, I gotta get out of here. This spot is dangerous. I guess it could be useful. Okay, this spot... Um, I might need a little bit... Oh jeez, dude. That might have been okay, though, because we have some... Have I seen you before? Oh yeah, oh, yeah okay. Oh, I, I gotta be careful about the explosion tendencies again. Yeah, there's a shell around me. But it's not invincible, so it's not like I can just rely on it forever. Thank you, thank you, thank you! Uh, if okay, I would rather have a little bit more. Give me a little bit more. Even killing two guys doesn't give me back enough soul for... one thing. It's corner for his papers again. Okay, maybe this is okay. Hopefully it'll be okay. First of all, we gotta get rid of those guys, because that's just a little bit too much right now. Oh no! Okay, I, I lost a little bit of health from that again. Now, back over here. I'm not sure if I can... Can I? If I... Mm, if I dash correctly and just have the maximum amount of space here. Boom! boom. Wanderer's Journal. Thank you. Okay. And again, that's something that we wouldn't have noticed because it's not really on the map. Oh! Wait. Oh no, that's the spot where the guy was just now. No. Oh, I thought I found a secret. That would have been a really tricky one, though. <laughs>